Hi everyone, welcome to the Evaporust Tip of the Week. If you've been watching this segment all season, you know that Evaporust is safe, simple, and easy to use. One of the main questions we get is, how to maintain the Evaporust, and then how do you dispose of it once it is spent? It's a great question. We get it all the time. Evaporust, of course, works fantastic. It takes rust off down to the bare metal and you put it in a bath like this mm -hmm. and, and you want to make sure that bath stays as healthy as possible. Right. So what I tell people is when you put it in the tub like this, take a marker right at the start and mark you a good line right on the line of the fluid so that you know where that was all the time. And the reason you want to do that is evaporust is water-based. The chemical in evaporust does not evaporate but water will. Mm -hmm. So if you leave this sitting out with this much surface area for three or four days, you're gonna lose a lot of water. How do you fix that? You go get your own water, you pour it in here, bring it back to that mark you made, stir it up, and it'll start working just like it always was. Evaporust needs water to function. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna use it over and over and over, and it's slowly, you're gonna notice it change colors. It's gonna go from a yellow to a brown. Eventually, it's gonna turn black like burnt motor oil. Right. And so how do you tell when it's dead? Simple, put your hands in it, and once you do this and you can't see through to your fingers, it's time to let your evaporust go and go get some more. So how do you dispose of it, Tasha? Well, it's super easy. At that point, whenever it is spent, it's like liquid iron. So it's like a fertilizer. What you can do is you can put it in a pump up sprayer, dilute it 10 to one with water, and then spray it on your grass. It'll green up your grass for about six weeks. So it truly is non-toxic, biodegradable, and easy to use. It's right. And uh, if you need more information about this, visit our website at evaporust.com.